Pro-Kremlin groups have been caught red-handed for staging a video allegedly showing Ukrainian soldiers harassing a woman and her baby. In the video clip, filmed on the woman's dash cam, a vehicle with a Ukrainian flag pulls over and two men in camouflage jump out of the car and start insulting the woman and then appearing to fire their weapons at her car while a baby sits right next to her. The two-minute video clip caused outrage among pro-Moscow officials uh, who widely shared this claiming to be evidence of Ukrainian troops uh, abusing civilians. In this now-deleted tweet, Russia's Ministry of Foreign Affairs referred to the Ukrainian soldiers in the video as Nazis, a common propaganda narrative pushed by the Kremlin since the start of the invasion. However, Internet sleuths were quick to debunk this video. GEO confirmed a group of volunteer investigators even managed to precisely locate the exact area where this video was filmed by analyzing, for example, the direction of the power lines, as well as the roads and the locations of the trees. The Twitter account determined that the action uh, took place here in Makiivka in the Russian-occupied Donetsk region. So it would make no sense that this road would be patrolled by Ukrainian soldiers if it's under complete Russian control. Another interesting point that's been made is the behavior of the alleged Ukrainian soldiers. If they're in Russian-occupied territory, why are they acting so relaxed? Moreover, dash camps have been banned in Ukraine since the start of the invasion, so normally under this law, uh, the camera of the woman would have been confiscated. The findings of GEO confirmed were also uh, confirmed by the Moscow Calling Telegram channel. A subscriber even went to the exact area and was able to photograph the surroundings, showing a clear match of the shape of the tree branches you see here, which are also visible on the staged video. And even uh, pro-Kremlin telegram channels admitted uh, this video was a fake. In a post, the pro-war channel said, uh, the video is fake. Our guys are clumsily practicing in carrying out such information operations. Our guys still have a lot to learn.